it's not Tinny. He'll be prettier than that. Come on, Buzz. Let's take him. Oh, thanks, Lens. Do I have a story to tell you? See, there was this really beautiful, smarty woman. We know! Now let's get back to Bourgeoisie. Ah, <laughs> Reggie, I hear you're quite the man about two. <laughs> Oh, you know, I'm trying to give myself a little taste now and then. That was me, oh, oh, you dirty wee bastard! If it weren't for you, Timmy would be fine now. So you better damn well get him back. Now, while you were gallivanting around saving this pathetic swine, Sappho's guard set up three new barracks. Here, take this sniper gun. Now go out and cap him right between the eyes. Sonak patrols, I'll deal with Mr. Horman. You didn't do too bad yourselves. But listen, if you want to learn the ways of the smarty... We don't. Start with this. I said we don't, you old... How can it? This could come in handy. Good. Now we're ready for the guard bunker. The what? Across the drawbridge. Now, keep your heads down. There are a lot of snipers in these hills. Once inside their base, you should quickly take out the catapults. That's how they send in reinforcements. Come on, lads. We hardly get any action these days. Here. I thought we were going to Planet Majorca. Nice teamwork, lads. Here, look at this. I've created a new bomb which will destroy the doors to the prison where they should be holding Timmy. Come on, give me a hand, Reg. What? It's called a pop-up bomb, and I've made it extra light so you'll be able to move around easily with it attached to your back. Lads! Oh. There it is! Dick went in prison. Those doors are the strongest of their kind. Listen, my boyos. If you set off the pop-up bomb right by those doors, you'll be able to get inside and free Timmy. And believe me, Timmy's spying ability will come in handy when you go up against the Sea Reaper oh, space. No, no, wait, wait, hang on, hang on. No one said anything about fighting Sea Reapers. French is right. Weapons are one thing, but spells and magic? No way. Yeah. Besides, we're supposed to be at Planet Majorca right ah, now. Ah, shut it! Come on, where's your spirit, lads? I mean, bloody hell, all we'd be doing at Planet Majorca right now is lying in the sun, sipping G&Ts and talking to the Majorcan ladies. Well, Timmy is a strong lad. He should probably learn to look after himself. Hey, maybe I could come along on your trip. What you say, Reg? Is it far from here? <laughs> no, you're talking about that. <laughs> hey, that didn't it? Oh. Look, we've got a job to do. Majorca can wait. Fine. Yes, yes, of course. Uh, Tim is in danger. Go on. Take out the doors to the prison. <laughs> mm. Well, that was a bit more powerful than expected. 
Come on! Let's look for survivors! Ha! G'day, mate. Crikey, I, I can't believe I've finally been rescued. Here, let me join you, fellas. Wait a sec. Don't get up. You're welcome. Uh, we're looking for Timmy, man. Have you seen him? Ah, oh, yes, yes, Timmy. Uh, he was my cellmate before they moved him. A real sport he was. Taught me how to sing. <laughs> Not much else to do hold up in a prison cell all day and night. Right, where is he now? Yes, sir. Uh, taught me to sing so many great songs. Smarty, me and unite. Drink the barrel dry. The old... G don't test us, lad, or you'll be feeling the end of me stick. Yes. Was that another one? <laughs> yes, yes. Oh, there were so many. Ow! Man's what an are you doing to me? Ah, they must have moved him to the torture tower. I feared as much. Yes. Yes, that's where they took my singing partner. Be a sport and bring him back. He sang like an angel. Here, here, this should help. It's called a Millennium Gun. <laughs> Big fella, isn't it? Crikey! He's never done that before. Tough bastard. Here, Baz! <coughs> You'd better handle this one. We'll need it if we're going to get to the torture tower. Well, I wait a minute. Bloody hell! Look at the size of this thing! Come on, lads, we've got to try this one out!